My name is Bryce Mayer. I'm the incident commander of the North Peace Complex, uh, which includes the uh, Parker Lake wildfire as, uh, as well as the Apache Creek wildfire and a few others in the area around Fort Nelson. Uh, over the last few days, we've had a, a positive turn in the weather, which has allowed all of our resources on the fire um, to work quite effectively closely together. Uh, that includes crews, heavy equipment and helicopters, and we're starting to make progress uh, along the fire's edge uh, close to town. Because of the longer term drought in the area, uh, we found and the crews have found that uh, the, fire, the fires burn quite deep, uh, which makes uh, the trees unstable. And there are certain areas uh, in, uh, around the wildfire uh, that the crews are finding it very difficult and challenging to work in. Uh, my name is Callum Richardson, Thunder Delta One. Uh, we're currently working in the northwest corner of the Parker Lake uh, wildfire. And uh, we're putting in a direct line uh, through a mix of aspen and spruce. Uh, the spruce is super unstable, so we've had to do a pretty thorough uh, danger tree assessment and falling uh, throughout. Yeah, so this is one of the harder patches that we worked through. Um, when we continue down the line, uh, we get into some easier ground, which we switched our operation from direct attack with uh, hoses and mop up and we switched to going to patrol. Uh, so currently on this line, we've been working two and a half days and we're hoping to have this line buttoned up by the end of the day here and moving on to a new section of ground. Over the next few days, we expect to see similar weather conditions uh, as we have been having. Uh, so cooler conditions, even though uh, tomorrow and the following day, we're expecting a bit more drying. Uh, and while we don't expect that to have a significant effect on the fire, fire behavior, uh, it does give us a chance to understand where there are potentially more areas of heat and focus our resources there.